Who? Are you sure this is going to work? I'm certain. <laughs> All we have to do is stick that on there, then this, and there. Wow! <laughs> I just wish fixing the dress was so simple. I think everything's clean now, Primrose. Oh, okay. Well, what should we do now? Um, why don't we paint some pictures? Violet's good at painting. You really miss her, don't you, Primrose? Yes. Well, why don't you go and see her? <gasps> but she ruined my dress. It was an accident. Is a dress really worth losing a friend over? Well... It's making you unhappy, and I'm sure Violet is sad too. But I can't go back. Not after shouting at her like that. How can I ever make it up to her? Why don't you give the jam tarts to Violet to say sorry? That's a wonderful idea. Oh, thanks, Violet. They're great. <laughs> 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 oh no! I've done it again! Is it really bad? No! Bumble, you've just given me a brilliant idea! Ready? Come on then. Oh! Uh, hello! Primrose, I'm so sorry about the dress. I'm sorry too. The jam tarts. Oh, uh, um, we made you these. Strawberry jam tarts! My favourite! <laughs> Bumble! There you are! Where have you been all day? Ooh. I've been trying to make it up to you. I'm so sorry about the flowers, Fifi. At least I can't break this flower with a sneeze. Thank you, Bumble. I love it. So, you're not mad with me? Mad? Of course not, Bumble. You're my friend. Just like Violet and Primrose are friends too. Aren't you? Definitely. Nothing is worth falling out about. Not even a dress. Uh, about the dress. Um, forget about it. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter anymore. That's the most beautiful dress I've ever seen. It was Bumble's idea. <laughs> Thank you, Bumble. <laughs> now that we're all friends again, who wants a jam tart? Me! 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 me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's happened? My necklace is broken and all the beads are lost. And now I'm sitting in a muddy puddle. <laughs> oh, dear. Perhaps we ought to cancel the tea party, Violet. Hmm. What if we have a make-it party instead? What's a make-it party? We each bring along some old bits and pieces we don't need anymore to make them into new things, just for primrose. Oh, yes. That sounds quite good fun. It won't make up for breaking my necklace. Mm. Shall we invite the other tots to the make-it party, Vivi? That's a lovely idea, Violet. Leave it to me. Thank you, Fifi. Primrose, oh, wait for me! Oh, I don't think Primrose likes me anymore, Fifi. She's just in a bad mood, Pip. But she'll cheer up soon. Especially if you hunt through the garden and try and find all her beads. Yeah! Uh, Pip the brilliant bead hunter! Yeah! He's on now, the trail! What was I going to do for Violet? Can you remember? Oh, that's right! Invite all the tots to the make it party. Thank you. <laughs> Fifi, forget me not. 
before I got. <laughs> What are you doing, Pip? Oh, hiya, Stingo! Primrose's favourite necklace broke, and I'm looking for the beads. Oh, yes! Hmm. Maybe me and Slugsy could help you find the beads, Pip. And uh, get a tasty reward, eh, Slugsy? Good <laughs> plan, boss! <laughs> yeah! Oh. Lots of odds and ends for the make-it party. Oh, lovely! Well, come on, everyone. Let's get started. Psst! Slugsy, I reckon the more beads we find, the more reward we'll get from Primrose. So, if Pip finds me, keep him talking while I grab them and put them in my bag. OK? OK, boss. <laughs> oh, here's one! Oh, <gasps> look! An elephant! Hmm. Nearly as nice as the colour of my broken necklace. Aha! Found another one! Look, Pip, a flying pig! <gasps> Where? <Well! laughs> That's quite a nice pillowcase, Violet. I could have kept my necklace under the hat if it hadn't got broken. Yes! Found another one! I don't believe it! Look! A tap dancing frog! Huh? <laughs> Very nice, Aunt Tulip. Nearly as pretty as my broken necklace. I seem to have found lots of beads. How about you, Pip? I don't understand it. I've only got one. Then me and Slugsy get the reward. Come on, let's take these beads back to Primrose. Hmm, they're very pretty, I suppose. Thank you. But they can't replace my broken necklace. Uh, Primrose? I'm sorry about your necklace. I tried to look for your missing beads and I found this. Is that all? You can't have looked very hard. Well, but I did. It's just that... Ah, never mind Slugsy... all that, Pip. Me and Slugsy found the rest. <gasps> My necklace beads! Oh, thank you, Stingo. So, do we get a reward? Yes. You can have the fruit scones I baked for the party. High five, Slugsy! Yeah, my man! Yay! All right! Well, that's not fair! Stingo didn't find them! I did! They tricked me! I didn't trick you! Did I, Slugsy? No, boss. I did. You told me to. Exactly. What? Oh, be quiet, you silly slug! Stingo, it's really unkind to trick Pip like that. Yeah, OK. Sorry, Pip. But Primrose has still got her beads back. So, how about that reward? Wait a minute. There are still two missing. <gasps> oh, Primrose, you've still got mud all over your dress. <laughs> oh, what are these? They look like you're missing beads, Primrose. They were stuck to my dress. <laughs> I found all my beads. Maybe Webby could string them back together. Many atoms make light work. <sighs> Here's your necklace, Primrose. Good as new. Thank you, Webby. And thank you, everyone, for finding my beads and making these pretty things. There's enough fruit scones for everyone. Even Stingo. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely, Fifi. What's the big secret, Violet? I'm organising a flower-topped flower festival in the marketplace, Fifi. Everybody must bring a flower or a plant to the festival. 
Whoever has the most original display will win a special prize. What a great idea! I really don't think buckets are the right sort of thing to grow flowers in, Violet. They'll look pretty, Primrose. Hello! I'm on my way to pick up some compost from Diggly's compost heap. Shall I get some for you, too? Oh, yes, please. What are you going to grow your flowers in, Fifi? My wheelbarrow. You can't take a wheelbarrow to a flower festival. <laughs> it doesn't matter what the flowers grow in, Primrose. Just as long as we get lots of lovely flowers on festival day. Shouldn't we grow some flowers, Bosch? So, I've got far more important things to do than pot plants. But there'll be a special prize. We can't win it if we don't take some flowers. Special prize, eh? So where can we get some flowers without going to all the trouble of growing them? Oh! <laughs> Bingo Stingo! That will do nicely. I watered them and put lots of compost in the buckets, but my plants are still a bit small. Have you tried singing to them? You can't sing to flowers. <laughs> I sing to my flowers. I think it makes them happy, and then they grow and grow. What do you sing, Fifi? Show a little love, give it some time. Add a little rain and sunshine. And seek is hot work. We need some water to cool us down. <gasps> oh, I forgot! Wait for me! Go, Mo! Go! Uh, Fifi, what did you forget? Oh, Pip! I forgot to water Violet's flowers! Buttercups and daisies! What am I going to give to Violet? <gasps> oh, a thunderstorm! Quickly, get under cover! Oh, I'm scared, Fifi! It's only a summer storm, Pip. I hear thunder, I hear thunder. Hark, don't you? Hark, don't you? Pitty patty raindrops. Pitter patter raindrops. I wet through. So are you. <laughs> oh, look. The rain stopped. <gasps> oh, wow. Look, a rainbow. <gasps> a rainbow. Fifi! Fifi! Bumble told us you had a surprise for Violet. I have. There you are, Violet. <gasps> A sky full of colour just for you. Oh, Beefy. The colours of the rainbow way up high. So beautiful in the sky. <gasps> From orange to My flowers! I picked these for you to give to Violet. What would I do without you, Bumble? Here is your second surprise, Violet. <laughs> Thank you for my rainbow in the sky. And my rainbow in your garden. <laughs> Don't forget to come back soon. <laughs> 